Uh, ladies and gentlemen, uh, the book is by Ephraim Gurman, uh, Smile, Tears and Thoughts at the Veterinary, behind the desk of Veterinary Office. And this story is Brief Tales of Stupidity, Misunderstanding and Confusion. Miracle Oncology Healing. Uh, client X brought a small dog to the vet. The client said to the breed it was Schutze. But there was no sign of breed, just a cloth of uh, dirty, muggly hair dread, uh, b because of uh, uh, dreaded together in one piece. The complaint were a big mass of the butt, deafness, and unruly behavior. The test showed that the mass was just a solid mat. The deafness was caused by plugging the ear and the vax in both ear canals, and the aggressiveness was due to the hair uh, painfully stacking uh, together from various parts of the body. The treatment, a shave and a wash, and so-called mass fell down to the floor with a sound so loud it could be made by stone. Of course, as dirty coat was removed, it could be referred as the external mass removed. The dog became much more friendly, and we didn't even need muzzle to finish the job. Zurab. Zurab usually brought us his poodles uh, for minimum services. Only mandatory vaccination, shaves, ear treatment, and similar minor things. He is the type of person with a strong in, uh, Eastern tradition of bargaining. Where the cha charge and just he would uh, get from us, he would whine, and it was impossible to be overpriced. There is a lot of informational material, advertising with, uh, for vet uh, insurance, brochures about flea prevention, supplements, city regulations regarding uh, pet care in our waiting room. Every time Zorab is in our office, he asks if you can take them home. Yes, you may take. They are free of charge. May I take two of each? Asks Zorab. Yes, you can. He takes three of each. How much does it cost? Uh, so much. Uh, it's impossible. Can I pay half a price? I found a solution for him. We give him the maximum price of anything he wants. Then, after several rounds of disputes, we slightly reduce the price and then I tell him, Go to hell! You're, we don't want you here as a customer. After this, he was fully satisfied. He thinks that he got bargained well until the lowest point. He pays the price and he would have otherwise charged him uh, from the very beginning and he leaves our office feeling happy as a winner.